What's up everyone, it's Chris with the Little Treasury Channel. Welcome back. This is where we bring you awesome watch content at least once a week. And if you haven't already, please make sure to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to be alerted as soon as we upload. I'm from Little Treasury Jewelers, which is located in Gambrels, Maryland. And it's where you go when you're in the know. As always, the watches that I review are for sale and can be purchased, so please see the description below to contact us. In our last video, we did a review of the brand new Oris Carl Brashear Caliber 401 Limited Edition, which is a beautiful bronze case piece with Oris's new Caliber 401 inside, which is very impressive. Today we are going to review the Citizen Thin Blue Line watches, which I actually did a video on a long time ago, so maybe you will remember this background. And I've had a lot of changes in my technology and my skill set since then, so I just wanted to redo the video and make it a little bit better for everyone, since these pieces are actually very special. More importantly, I think everyone out there can relate to the fact that we know somebody that's a police officer, and these pieces represent all the hard work that the police officers do to keep us safe. So, let's get on to the video. Citizen has made these pieces to recognize and commemorate the bravery and dedication of our servicemen and women who risk their lives for the safety of everyday citizens. Citizen has designed these special edition watches, the men's based on the Nighthawk and the ladies based on the silhouette, featuring the iconic thin blue line on the dial and a unique insignia on the case back. All pieces come with a mandatory engraving on the case back and a special gold-plated card that we will show later on in the video. Before we move on, it's that time everybody, go ahead and smash the subscribe button. It's somewhere down here, somewhere in this vicinity here. Go ahead and smash it right now, and then let's get on to the features. The men's thin blue line is in stainless steel and has a 40.67 millimeter case width, 13.36 millimeter thickness, 46.84 millimeter lug to lug and a 22 millimeter lug width. It weighs in at 157.58 grams. While the ladies version is also in stainless steel and has a 36.27 millimeter case width, a 10.31 millimeter thickness, a 42.85 millimeter lug to lug and an 18 millimeter lug width with a weight of 98.91 grams. The men's version has an all matte case, a screw down crown at the three with a chronograph start and stop pusher at the two and a chronograph reset pusher at the four. While the ladies piece has a high polished finished case with a non screw down crown at the three position. Both pieces have a mineral glass crystal, which is to be expected at this price point versus sapphire. The dial of the men's thin blue line is in a dark gray with Arabic numerals on the 12, 3, 6, and 9 markers and trapezoidal markers as the rest. The hands are sword style and in white. A tachymeter is found around the chapter ring. The subdial at the top middle section measures the chronograph time up to 60 minutes. The subdial at the left portion has a 24 hour time indicator. The subdial at the lower bottom area is a small seconds complication and will measure your actual seconds if you aren't familiar, while the big second hand is for your chronograph. EcoDrive WR200 can be found to the right of the subdial. A date aperture with a blacked out background and white numerals can be found at the three position and Citizen is in a black chrome above it. Most importantly, you have the thin blue line going horizontally across the center of the timepiece. Loom can be found on all indices and on the hour and minute hands. The dial of the ladies model is black with Citizen at the top center, crystals for the hour markers, a circular ring of crystals around the perimeter, pencil style hands in high polish, a subdial at the left portion that tells you the day of the week, a subdial at the right portion that shows you the date, and a subdial at the bottom portion that shows 24 hour time. The thin blue line is going directly across the center of this piece as well. Loom can only be found on the hour and minute hands of this piece though. 
The case back on each shows off a thin blue line flag logo and has room above it for engraving, which would typically be your rank, last name, and badge number. This gold card also comes with these pieces and the purchase date, serial number, and rank, last name, and badge number will be engraved on here as well when you purchase one of these. What is engraved though is really up to you and it could be anything that you'd like. The movement on both pieces is called the Eco Drive, which is Citizen's famous solar powered quartz movement. When it's fully charged, the power will last for 210 days without any light. If these movements ever die, just put them in your window for four days with the crown pulled out and they usually will come right back to life. These also come with a five-year warranty. The men's piece has a three-link style bracelet that uses a safety-locking fold-over clasp and has a micro-adjustable buckle, while the ladies' piece has a simple three-link design and a simple dual pusher clasp. The men's piece is 200 meter water resistant, while the ladies' piece is only 50 meter water resistant. The retail price for the men's is $550, while the retail price for the ladies is $475. However, if these pieces are purchased for a law enforcement officer, you'll get the men's piece for a wonderful $295, and the ladies' piece for a wonderful $275. Now for my humble opinion. The ladies watch is pretty and would make a great gift, but let's talk about the men's since I just can't wear the ladies without looking stupid. I think that the Nighthawk has been a great piece by Citizen for many years and that they chose a great platform for the thin blue line watch with it. It looks great on my six and a half inch wrist and the meaning behind these is definitely worth looking into. The quality of the case and bracelet is worth every penny at this low price point. I'll recommend this piece for anyone who wants to honor our great police officer officers or just simply like how cool these pieces look and the great value that you get at this wonderful price point. Thanks for watching today everyone. I hope you really enjoyed the content and please please make sure to hit that subscribe button because right now I think 97% of the people that are watching are not subscribed so don't be that guy. Just smash that subscribe button and we'll look forward to seeing you next video.